Helen Wyman, second place today. Was that okay? Yeah, that was that was more than okay. I I felt really good this at the beginning of the season since I've come back from America and I thought I could do well here and it's a really hard course and it's hot but it's like you're just sweating the whole time. It's it's really humid heat so it was okay and then I got a average start but managed to work through quite quick and then Katie was nowhere to be seen and I was thinking like seriously what do I do now? <laughs> There's no one driving the race forward, what do I do? So um, I tried to, to break as many people as I could and then I was starting to crack people and then she came past and then you've got a carrot to follow so I tried to follow her which I managed to follow about 170 meters and then, <laughs> and then just hold on. Was it a problem, the heat today? Not really because it's, so it's so wet so as soon as you stop you're just sweating the whole time so I didn't even think I need a drink or anything whereas in America when it was hot it was like 0% humidity and I can't imagine how horrible that is <laughs> but yeah here it was, it was sweaty but it was okay. At the end it was 12 seconds or something like that on Katie, that's not uh, many. No, but she was about a minute down, wasn't she, at one point? <laughs> so, yeah, it's not a lot. It's not a lot. And, and every, every week, Katie gets stronger, but she also makes a few mistakes. And when she makes that mistake, you have to try and take a chance. And today, with two laps to go, she hadn't caught us. And I was thinking, oh, my God, this is for the win. And, and then, yeah, with a lap to go, she came past. But she's strong, you know. You have to try and beat her when she makes a mistake, not so. Is this really a hard course? Oh, it's so hard. It's rock hard. And you have to run more than you've ever had to run because the off cambers are in the shade, so they didn't get dry at all, and you had to run those, and everyone else had run, so there was no lines. And Yeah, it was brutal. It was really, really brutal. Your next race is Koppenberg? Uh, next Van Awarden on Tuesday. I want to win cheese. You get lots of cheese on the podium. That's good. And afterwards, Koppenberg? And afterwards, Koppenberg, yeah. That's something special for you also? Very special, equal prize money from 2020 cycles and yeah, the first C1 race in Europe to, to do equal prize money, so that would be, that's huge. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Thank you, Julian.